Hey, what's happening guys? Welcome back to the channel and to the start of a new series. Me playing this game known as Broken Window, where I get to stare at a shattered window all day long waiting for something interesting to happen. This is gonna be a thrilling 100 part series, each episode an hour long. <laughs> How am I, YouTuber? I'm not funny. Welcome to The Last of Us, a game that is nearly eight years old and I'm just now getting to it. Please don't hit me. Well, here's the thing. Actually, there's a new game coming out, which you guys will all know this, The Last of Us 2. I have never played this game, and I was looking through the comments on YouTube uh, of my videos, and a lot of people were asking me to play this. Not quite sure why you guys want me to play a game that's nearly a decade old, but you know what? That's fine by me. I think I'll try it out, and uh, I've always wanted to play this game. Fun story. I actually never played single player story mode games until recently when I started YouTube and I was doing it for my gaming channel. Prior to that, I was only playing shooters all day long. Call of Duty, Battlefield, Halo. I never thought story mode games were fun and then I started playing them and I, I must admit, they are way more fun than playing shooters. The Last of Us, I'm sure this is gonna be you know, in one of my top 10 favorite games. I just got to be playing Red Dead Redemption 2, Days Gone, Resident Evil. There are so many amazing games out there and there's so much more thrilling than running around mindlessly shooting people in a multiplayer game. I'm sure a lot of people will disagree with that, but I have been converted. So with that being said, if you guys are excited for The Last of Us, a game that's nearly a decade old and I'm just now getting to it. If you guys are excited, smash the like button, leave a comment down below, and let's go. All right, here we go. The Last of Us. Uh, I am playing this on a controller because I'm on the PlayStation because this is a PlayStation exclusive. So I'm sure you guys know that I have a legendary status in the gaming world as being the worst person to ever play video games. My accuracy, my aim is terrible. Borderline non-existent. So this could be quite embarrassing for both of us. What a thrilling start. We've got some dust, some floating dust. Oh boy. You guys trolled me hard. This game's gonna be really boring, isn't it? <laughs> Only joking. So I think this is a zombie game. A lot of people don't like zombie games, but I love zombie games. Uh, Days Gone, Resident Evil, two of my favorite games I've ever played. And of course, the legendary Naughty Dog Studios. I think they're legendary. Okay, there's a child sleeping. Tommy, I, Tommy, Tommy, listen to me. He is the contractor. He's the contractor, okay? I can't lose this job. Oh, shit. I, I understand. Let, let's talk about this in the morning. Is she morning, sleeping okay? on the couch? <laughs> we'll talk about it in the morning. Well, that's uncomfortable. All right, good night. Go to bed, child. Hey. Scoot. Sunday at work, huh? Thrilling. What are you still doing up? It's late. Oh, God, what time is it? It's way past your bedtime. But it's still today. It's not even midnight yet. Come on now. Honey, please not right now. I do not have the energy for this. Here. What's this? Your birthday? Oh, my heart's melting. She stayed awake just to give her dad a present. Oh, that's so cute. You kept what is it? in a back broken watch. A watch? No, uh, figured, you know. It's not an Apple like watch, it? but... Honey, this is, it's what? nice, but I, I think it's stuck. It's not. What? No, 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 no. Oh, ha, ha. Oh, he was trolling her. Where did you <laughs> get the money her. for this? Drugs. I sell hardcore drugs. Oh, my God. <laughs> open out with the mortgage then. Yeah, you wish. Hey, you can never tell. Kids these days, they're into everything. Oh, wow. Ah, oh, she stayed awake just long enough to give her dad a present, and then she fell back asleep. That's so cute. See, that's why you don't, you don't come home grumpy. You never know when there's a present waiting for you. I mean, I would never have a present waiting for me if I came home. Huh. The watch isn't too bad though. It's a pretty good present. Better than anything I ever received. Look at that old landline phone. You know that baby girl. What, you didn't even put the covers around her? Come on, she might get sick. She might get pneumonia. I need to get your daddy on the phone. Uh, Uncle Tommy, what, what time is it? I need to talk to your dad now. There's something. Uh oh. Uh, Uncle Tommy? Uh, hello? And the zombie apocalypse starts. I like how she has that convenient baseball bat right next to her nightstand. Ooh, why do I have a feeling I'll have to use this thing? What was that all about? All right. 
right. Oh, and you got the glow in the dark stickers on the ceiling. Damn, she's got a lit room. See, when I was a kid, I always wanted to have a room like this, but I was, I was stuck in the basement with my brothers. I'm not even kidding. We were in the basement, three of us. Nothing but just a bed. Fun times. She's got, oh my God, a computer, headphones. Damn girl, you got a gaming setup. You might want to try and start a YouTube channel. What is this? Oh, dang it. I forgot to give this to him. Oh, it's his birthday card. You're not a fossil yet. <laughs> Love the banter. Dear dad, let's see. You're never around. You hate the music I'm into. You practically despise the movies I like. And yet somehow you still manage to be the best dad every year. How do you do that? Happy birthday, Pop Sarah. Oh, that's so cute, man. This game's melting my heart. Nah, I'm joking. I don't have a heart. All right. So what happened to her uncle? Probably something terrible. You know, for a game that came dad? out in 2013, the graphics aren't too bad. I mean, granted, this is the remastered version, uh, but still, not too bad at all. Hello? Pops! Where are you? Oh, we have a newspaper. Um, hmm. 300% increase due to mysterious infection. <gasps> the coronavirus, oh no! All right, well then. It's always kind of funny when games give us an option to roam around trying to find someone. If it were me Daddy? and I'm trying to call for someone, I would just yell from my room at the top of my lungs. <laughs> if they don't respond, that's on them. Oh. Hey, Pops, you in here? You in here? Seem to be somehow connected to the nation. Oh my God, that is a bright TV. <laughs> We've received reports that victims afflicted with the infection show signs of increased aggression and. Oh, they, they called in the military. Oh! What was that? Okay. Well, that's not good. You know when the... Oh, shit! Okay, when the military's called in, there's explosions yeah. happening on live television. Shit is going to go down. Oh, this is bad. And where's her father at? Damn, Dad, you gotta clean your room up. This place is messy. Dad? There we go. There's the type of volume I would have if I'm trying to yell for my dad. <laughs> what is going on? Well, I think the uh, the apocalypse may be starting. Oh my God, that's, that's so cool. I have goosebumps. Oh, something about cops flying by the road at night. It's always scary. I feel like the police are after me sometimes. I'll just be laying in bed and I'll just see cops go past my window. I'm like, oh shit, they're after me. But no, I'm a law-abiding citizen. Maybe that's her dad calling. Eight missed calls. Where the hell are you? Young lady, Only watch your mouth. You're a child. Home. Saying hell like that? Oh, she's reading the text message. Oh my God. <laughs> I need to shut up. All right, we have dogs barking outside. <laughs> Oh, wow, you can see the reflection? I, I don't know why I'm impressed by this. I guess it's because this game came out a long time ago. Wait, was that? That tire swing was moving. Oh shit, there's something out there. <laughs> this is why you don't leave the lights off in the middle of the night. It's so scary. It's just too scary, man. Hey, I leave my lights on at night. I don't even care. If you're a burglar, a ghost, or whatever, you're not coming into a house that's fully illuminated. Just, it's not gonna happen. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Shit! You scared me! You are. Sarah, are you okay? Yeah. Does anyone come in here? No oh, he's grabbing for the heat. Oh, here. shit! Don't go near the doors. Just, just stand back there. Dad, you're kind of freaking me out. What's going on? It's the Coopers. Some ain't ride with them. I, th I think they're sick. Goodness. They've been bitten. Oh my God! Jesus. Jimmy! Dad? Honey, come here. Come here. Is he covered in blood? Jimmy. He is. Jimmy, Jimmy I am. Oh, running. Jimmy's long gone. Shoot that bitch! Yeah. All right, Jimmy. See you later. How did they turn so fast? You shot him. Sarah. Something this morning. Sammy, there is something bad going on. And we have got to get out of here. Do you understand me? Yeah. Tommy, come on. Oh. Come on. Get in 
the hell you been? You have any idea what's going on out there? I got some notion. Holy shit. You got blood all over you. Hey, mine. Let's just get out of here. You're saying half the people in the city lost their minds. Can we just please go? Some sort of parasite or something. Huh. Not a parasite. Tell me what happened? Later. The parasites don't cause that. Yes, How you holding up, honey? I'm fine. Can we hear us on the radio? Yeah, sure thing. Thanks. Man, Jimmy got so, wasted. <laughs> the radio. Yeah, we're doing great. A minute ago, newsman wouldn't shut up. He said where to go. He said, uh, Army's put up roadblocks on the highway. No getting into Travis County. We need to get the oh, this is out. Texas! Take I live in Texas! There they go. Did they say how many are dead? Probably a lot. We found this one family all mangled inside their Tell house. Right. She just saw someone get shot. I think you can tell her the story in detail. <laughs> she can handle it. Jesus Christ, how did this oh happen? my god. They got no clue. But we ain't the only town. At first they're saying it's just the south. Now they're going on about the east coast, the west coast. Holy hell. Man, the Everyone virus spreads far. fast. Jesus. Everyone got infected so instantly. I'm sure he did. Were we sick? No, of course not. Oh, yo, know? Austin! They said it's just uh, people in the city. We're good. Didn't Jimmy work in the city? That's she raises a did. fair point. We're fine, trust me. All right. Was it an See, airborne baby? attack? Think you're doing? Keep driving. I got a kid, Joe. So do we. But we have room. Hey. Keep hey. driving. Nah, nah, nah. Homie. Sorry, homie. We are out. You guys may be infected. You see what I see? Someone else will come along. Yeah, right. <laughs> They're dead. Why are we driving towards the town? Get out of here. Go the other way. Are you kidding me? And I feel bad for anyone working in the hospital tonight. They're gonna be busy. Everyone and their mother had the same damn idea. Oh, see, this is why you don't try that. Good, just backtracking. Hey, what the fuck, man? Let's go. Oh, there's an infected patient. Yo, 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 put this bitch in reverse. Tommy. Tommy. Holy My shit. God. Oh, yo, get out of here. Pedal to the metal, baby. Oh, 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 oh. Did you see that? Yes, I saw it. God damn. Turn here, turn here. Oh. Come on, people, move. Oh, okay, I thought they were a horde of zombies. <laughs> Give us a I'm trying. Oh, no. Sorry about that, Pops. You can't stop here, I can't fucking drive through them, Joe. back up there. They're behind me, too. There, there, there. Hold on. Where are they Go. running from? Hey, sometimes you got to run over some people. Oh, shit. Okay, never mind. I take that back. They had the same idea I had. <laughs> Was it an airborne attack? How could so many people get infected so quickly? Hey. Hey. Get back, man. Get back. Okay, all right, let's break out of here. There we go. Thank God you've got boots on. You never know when you're gonna have to kick through a windshield. Damn, it's all bloodied up. I guy got destroyed, look at him. He was ripped to shreds. Oh, oh. <laughs> I was about to say, that's not English. Thank you. Dad? Come here, baby. Come here, come give me your hand. Please tell me you've got a gun with you. What is Please it? tell me you have a gun. My leg hurts. How bad? bad. Oh, she broke her leg. Run. Yup, there we go. No, what are you doing? Come on, baby. Okay, well, I guess you want to save your daughter, right? That's, that's probably a good idea. All right, I'm going to run with the crowd. That's a great idea. Where do we go? Oh, my God. It's so violent. Oh, 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 my God. Okay, all right, maybe I should try and run a little bit faster. All right, let's go, let's go. Double time, double time, double time. Can I run any faster, please? Go oh, look, Sarah. I feel safer running with the crowd. At least that way there's a few other people around me that'll get picked off by the zombies. 
Oh my god! Why are they doing that? Oh! Oh! Woo! Oh. Oh. Come on! It's kind of hard to ignore that screaming. Now, how is everything on fire? So dramatic. Oh shit, okay, we're being overrun by zombies. I'm following you. I hope you know the way out of here. Go! Man, we're in Texas. All you have is a revolver? Are you. Oh shit! Shoot this man! I don't kick him, shoot him! Thank you! God damn it, we're almost there. We're almost there, baby. This is Texas. Everyone's got it. at least a shotgun. I mean, come on. Keep going. Find your way out of here. Oh, all right. I see the beer. Definitely Texan. Where's the shotguns? Where's the ARs? Shoot the hands. Shoot the hands. Go. You got Sarah. I can outrun him. Uncle Tommy? I will meet you there. Hurry. What a brave sacrifice. We will miss you. He's going to be fine. I am so sorry, sir. But I got a little girl to protect. Oh, 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 come on! Double time! Why am I so slow? Dad? Hold on, hold on! You boys just trying to outrun a zombie that's starving. Oh, eat this man! Eat this man! He's almost dead anyway! Oh, now they're doubling up! Oh. Okay, there we go. There's a true Texan. Okay. He's got a machine We're gun. We're safe. Oh, it's hey. the military. We need help. Stop! Please. It's my daughter. I think her leg is broken. Stop right there! Okay. Well, that's We're not how. Not sick. I've got a couple of civilians on the outer perimeter. Please advise. Eddie, what about Uncle Tommy? We're gonna get you to safety and go back for him, okay? Sir, there's a little girl. But. Oh, he just got the command to, yes, to put sir. us down. Are you serious? We've just been through hell. Okay, we just need. Dude, there's no way you can do that. Shoot a little girl? Oh, damn! Oh, that does it. I'm gonna pop your ass. That sounded wrong. Please don't. Okay, well then, there's Uncle Tommy. Oh, no. Sarah. Move your hands, baby. I know, baby, I know. Oh, come on, that's so sad. Listen to me, I know this hurts. You're gonna be okay, baby. Stay with me. All right, I'm gonna pick you up. I know, baby. I know it hurts. Come on, baby. Please. I know, baby. I know. Sarah. No way. She dies? Baby. How is the game gonna do that to me? I just started. I just started playing. You can't tear my heartstrings out like that. Come on. Bro. What a monster. Who shoots a child? I don't care if it's an order from the high command. I wouldn't do it. Please don't. She wasn't even infected. Wow, what a terrible start, dude. Come on. You're going to let a child die? Not even die. She got gunned down by the military. The governor has called a state of emergency. Or hundreds and hundreds of bodies lying in the streets. Parents Somehow I wonder how this would actually go down in real life. A report from the World Health Organization showed that the latest vaccination tests have failed. With the bureaucrats out of power, we can finally take the necessary steps. Los Angeles is now the latest city to be placed under martial law. All residents are required to report to their designated quarantine. Riots have continued for a third consecutive day, and winter rations are at an all-time low. Mm, it's chaos in the street. themselves the Fireflies have claimed responsibility for both attacks. Their public charter calls for the return of all branches of government. Demonstrations broke out following the execution of six more alleged Fireflies. Who the hell are the Fireflies? A rebel group? With us. A resistance group, I'm, I'm, I'm guessing? The darkness, look for the light. Yeah, Believe that has to be it. All right, well then. I'm guessing the entire United States military has collapsed, or at the very least, they're not as effective as they once were. And now there's rebel groups appearing all over the place, like the Fireflies. Maybe not, I'm not quite sure, but... Okay, so this is... Wow, 20 years later? Well, that's quite the jump. I'm coming. 
Did she actually die? Did he really lose his daughter? <clears throat> well, hello, hello. Who are you? How was your morning? Want one? No, I don't want one. Well, I have some interesting news for you. Where were you, Tess? West End District. Hey, we had a drop to make. We. We had a drop to make. Well, you wanted to be left alone, remember? So I'll take one guess. The uh, whole deal went south and the client made off with our pills. Is that about <laughs> right? Deal went off without a hitch. Enough ration cards to last us a couple of months. Easy. You want to explain this? I was on my way back here, and I got jumped by these two assholes, all right? And yeah, they got a few good hits in, but... Look, I managed. Give me that. Are these assholes still with us? <laughs> well, that's funny. At least find out who they were. Yeah, look, they were a couple of nobodies. They don't matter. What matters is that Robert fucking sent them. Who's Robert? Our Robert. He knows that we're after him. He figures he's gonna get us first. Son of a bitch, he's smart. <laughs> he's not smart enough. I know where he's hiding. Black Hill, you do. Old warehouse in Area 5. Can't say for how long, though. Well, I'm ready now, yeah? Oh, I can do now. Okay, then. So Robert tried to jump us, or at least send a few of his boys in. So what are we? Are we, uh... Are we part of a smuggling group? Well, I guess that wouldn't make sense. We have ration cards, right? So I guess we have to be doing something that, that's semi-legal. At least I think so. Man, I'm so disappointed that his daughter died. I can't get over that. Well, you want a few hours left until curfew. Well, we better hurry up then. Oh, wow. 20 years has made a difference. I gotta serve the damn papers this morning. I've been selected for outside work duty. Oh, that's such crap. Soldiers are supposed to handle the outside. Man, screw I'll the soldiers. Sure what about you, Joel? Bunch of monsters? You summoned for this bullshit yet? Nope. Yeah. <laughs> I bet. Curfew hours, street hours, 6 p.m. to 6 a.m. Anyone caught without proper papers will be arrested on the spot. Well, damn, they're not playing around. Do they shoot you as well? Do they shoot children? See, that's what makes me wonder. If something like this were to happen in real life, what would the government do? What would be their, uh, their response? Would they just gun citizens down in the infected area? Assuming there was something this terrible, a virus that made you go violently crazy. Would they? I seriously doubt it. At least I hope not. I have a little bit more faith in humanity than that. Seek the fire. Oh, fireflies, okay. Federal uh, incident security force, free. So the fire fi fireflies <laughs> want to be free from the federal government. I'm guessing that's the case. Man, what a difference 20 years has made. Look at this place. Attention. It looks like it was bombed. Compliance with all city personnel is mandatory. Look at that. Ration line hasn't opened yet. It must be running low again. This is kind of scary. Because think about this: if if something were to happen to put out all the electronic devices in our country or any country that relies heavily on them, like America, for example, people would be screwed. I don't even know how to get across the street where I live. I have to use GPS for everything. I use the internet for all my information. I wouldn't even understand how to survive on my own without the internet technology being able to go and purchase things with a credit card, a debit card. If something bad were to happen that knocked out the internet or knocked out the ability to use electronic devices, I couldn't even buy stuff because I, all I use is a credit card. Well, debit card. I'm not in debt yet. Although I would like to get some plastic surgery, then maybe. Go. So uh, I'm guessing we're in a quarantine zone. Oh, what's happening here? Oh, damn, why so violent? Okay, they're scanning people for the virus, I'm guessing. Yeah, they are. He's clean. Oh, that's so scary. So what's their, uh... Oh! Oh, damn! Alright, listen, I'm just trying to get a better look. I was about to ask, what's their, uh... 
down. I was gonna say, what's their procedure for someone that's that, that, that's infected? But it seems to be just exterminate them. Oh, of course, that makes sense because they don't have an actual cure yet. There's no um, whatever the word is. There's no cure for the people that are uh, actually sick. So of course they would put them down. Oh, that would suck. Moving along. Yes, sir. We'll stay put. Okay, this place has been bombed. More people are getting infected. Look at that building. It's just leaning on the other one. <laughs> How has it not collapsed? Oh, this is scary. I feel like we're part of a, a, a regime now, not actually America, not a democracy. They got us all new papers. They shouldn't give us any static up there. Quite cool. Right on through. Following you, milady. Checkpoint South Five. Howdy, boys. Howdy, howdy, howdy. See you later. What's your business here? Got the day off. Visiting a friend. All right. Move on through. Thanks. My man, your eyes are bloodshot. Okay, wow then. What, what the hell happened here? Close it up. Oh, fireflies. Okay, they are against the federal government. They're trying to fight back. Uh, pull back and press X uh, to quick turn. Okay, here we go. Oh, that's a weird button to sprint. <laughs> All right, well then, there goes my day off. Attention. Checkpoint 5 is now closed Come until on. further notice. All civilians must clear the surrounding area. I wanted to see outside the city, or rather outside our area. So much for the easy route. Patch yourself up, all right? What is that? Um... Bind up your wounds with a health kit, okay? Should be easy enough. Select and R2. Oh, of course, it's toilet paper. Every single game, it's the same thing. You roll some toilet paper up around your arms and you're good to go. We're gonna have to go around the outside. Outside the wall. Or we could just let Robert go. <sighs> Cute. No, I don't think so. Now, what's, what's their relationship? See that shit? I was there. Hey, how's the East Tunnel looking? It's clear. I just used it. No patrols. And where are you off to? Gonna pay Robert a visit. <sighs> you too? Who else is looking for him? Uh, Marlene. She's been asking around, trying to find him. Marlene? What do the Fireflies need with Robert? <laughs> you think she'd tell me? Well, what did you tell her? The truth. I got no idea where he's hiding. Good man. Hey, you stay out of trouble, all right? Military's gonna be out in force soon. Yeah, see you around. U.S. Army? Odd. Why do they have all these uh, rooms locked off? This guy's just got some random pigeons in a dog cage. <laughs> so what's their relationship, Joel and Tess? Are they partner Marlene partners, romantically, Robert? or just partners in their business? I don't like it. We better find them before the fireflies do. What the? Why are all these rooms sealed off like that? They got some goodies in here? Trying to hide the machine guns and the dynamite? Oh, I see how it is. This is us. Hey guys, how's it going? <sighs> Shit's stirring up out there. How are we looking over here? Uh, it's been quiet. No signs of military or infected. That's what I like to hear. Oh, come on, that is so Joel, obvious. With this. There's no way the military hasn't found this yet. What do I do? Oh, there we go. Okay, I was about to say. Well then again, who's gonna take the time to try and move every piece of furniture out of the way, right? I mean, I would. I'll take it easy out there. All right, all right. Down we go into the secret tunnel. Oh, God, this place reeks. I need to watch for the throw away down here. Yeah, like possibly the infected. So I'm guessing clearly we are not working for the government. Maybe we're working for like the, uh, the black market or fireflies or something. Well, no, that wouldn't make sense. We ran when the fireflies attacked the patrol border, but still. We're obviously trying to do something a little bit I'm shady. I'm still here from last time. Oh, now we're talking, baby! Give me some heat. Thank you, thank you. It's not a machine gun, but I'll take not it. a lot of ammo. I don't think the shots count. Gas mask? A, uh, a bag? Do I have some mollies? No? Okay, shit. All right. One gun and a few bullets. Not too bad. I mean, not too good either, but uh, I suppose it's better than nothing. Four bullets? All right, Texas. Boost me up. A few on standby, but still, that's not a lot. 
All right, time for some parkour action. You ready? Yes, ma'am. <sighs> I love Joel's beard. I wish I could grow a beard like that. Maybe in another Come lifetime. On. How do I? Oh, there we go. What a jump. Damn, girl, you are strong. Whew. You've not been missing gym sessions, huh? Go on. Be careful. What am I not? <laughs> that a trick question? Oh. Okay, we're out of the zone. I'm guessing this is sort of like no man's land. Ain't been out here in a while. It's like we're on a date. Well, I am the romantic type. <laughs> you got your ways. Yes, nothing more romantic than going into the no man's land zone of a zombie ridden land. Full of peril. Where's the ladder? Well, it's gotta be around here somewhere. Man, it's crazy. Look at how overgrown this is. 20 years makes a big difference. There's the barbed wire. Everything's been zoned off. All right, uh, what are we doing? Ladder? Ladder. Where's the ladder? Hey, try over there. All right, hold up. Oh, maybe over here? Ah, there you are, you sneaky bugger. You can't hide from me. Come here. We gotta Got scale it. the side of a building. Bring it over. Uh, press the view tutorial. Place ladders against walls to access higher areas. Okay, well, I guess that makes sense. And then we can lay a ladder flat to cross uh, between the gaps of buildings. Got it. Ladders serve a multi-purpose. I like it. Unless they happen to break, then that's not so much fun. And placed. Ladies first. <laughs> Lady, you must be thinking of someone else. It's <laughs> all relative. This way. Ooh, a pool table. Kind of moldy, but you know, you down for a game of pool? No? Okay. Oh, please be some ammo. I'm guessing not. Anything that's out here has probably been scavenged thoroughly. Oh, bolts. Oh, okay, yeah, punch the bolts, punch them. We found some parts, some gears, okay. I'm guessing I can craft at some point. Sorry, just looking around, trying to find supplies since all you gave me is like 10 bullets. 10 bullets, a rusty gun, and uh, what appears to be a very old backpack. Firefly pendant, what is this? David Michael, okay. Well, David Michael, I guess you're dead. All right, enough dawdling. Let's get to this very secret location. Start Down earning some here. money, or rather some ration cards. Love doing a lot of dangerous work just to barely be able to survive and eat probably guns. stale food. For his sake, he better. Look, once we get our merchandise back, it should be easy to unload. Well, speaking of merchandise, when's that next shipment due? Oh, well, we're meeting Bill next month. More pills, lots of ammo, supposedly. Hold up, spores. Oh, that looks dangerous. Lead the way! Come on, I, I don't want to have to go first. So I'm guessing the virus can be carried by various means. Obviously, from human to human, right? That's typically how viruses can go around. Or from spores, from? too. The place was clear last time. They're coming out of something. Stay alert. Why do I feel like I'm going to find a dead body down here? There's our culprit. Oh, there we go. Not that old. Better keep your eyes and ears open. Oh, do I have a flashlight? Now I've got my gun. I've got a brick, which I currently don't have one. Okay. Oh. Oh my God, what the hell? This place is disgusting. Can we get out of here? It's very unsettling. Here. You okay? Yeah. Damn ceiling's falling apart. Be careful. This way. I wonder how many types of zombies we're going to encounter, or rather, the infected. She's not. Watch it, watch it. Help me. Is that. Oh shit, it's a living person. How long have you been down here? Hey, we got a gun! Please. What do you want to do? Alright, this is a tough decision, but uh, you know, the military did shoot my daughter for no reason, so I think I need to exact some revenge. 
Sorry, homie. It's Poor the ways of the streets. No, I'm joking. There's no streets out here. It's the ways of survival. If you lost your mask and you were exposed to spores, clearly you were going to turn. So it's the best thing we could have done for him. Plus, it makes it easier on me if I don't have to encounter more and more infected people along the way. That would suck, though, to be infected. Up ahead. You hear that? Shh, shh. Hello? Who's over here? Oh, oh, that's so freaky. All right, hold R1 to focus on Joel's hearing. Wow! <laughs> Damn, he has got some good hearing. I can see through the walls. Sneak up on the effect and then grab them by pressing triangle, okay? Hello, little fellow. It's time for your nap. Oh man, I messed that one up. All right. Oh shit, Tess, out of the way. See, I told you guys, I have legendary bad aim. How did I mess that up? Ooh, yeah, that's right. Bitch slap the zombies. There we go. Or infected, I suppose. They're not zombies, right? I don't think they call them zombies in the game. Damn! How many right hooks does it take to put you down? The infected got mega strength or something. All right, buddy. Sit down. There we go. What a waste of ammo. I'm not the stealthiest guy out there. Oh, shit. Damn! Have you considered MMA or something? All right, that's all of them. You may have a career. Let's hope so. All right, uh, how do I heal again? Let's head back into the city. Um, okay, I guess I don't have bandages currently. Sorry about that. I told you guys, I'm terrible, terrible at games, especially on the console. <laughs> Although it was kind of fun being able to just punch some zombies in the face. And I am impressed with Joel's hearing. He's like a, a bat with sonar or echolocation, whatever bats have. All right, found some more ammo. I guess that's useful. A window, nothing out there. Uh, I guess we go, which way do we go? Do I have a map of some sort? Map, no I don't, hmm. This is like a labyrinth, it's a maze. I don't know what I'm doing. You know, Tess, you could try and help your boy out here. Kinda clueless. Oh, here we go, no, that's not it. Okay, that's boarded up. Um, where in the, oh, up the stairs, obviously. You're such an idiot. Yes, I know I am. All right, up, 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 up we go. Hey, the light and no spores, thank God. No ammunition, unfortunate. Anything of value in here? I really hope I can find a juicy gun, like an AR-15, a shotgun, something. I mean, if we're still in Texas, you would hope they have at least better guns than a few revolvers and uh, pistols. Note to brother. Uh, really? Oh, read, I was about to say. Hey brother, we, are, uh, we were so close. I'm sitting outside the walls knowing I'll never see the inside of the zone. While waiting for the smuggler to show up, we heard a squad of soldiers approaching. In our panic, we ducked into the bu this building in, hope, in hopes of hiding from them. None of us noticed the spores until it was too late. We're all infected. We have a few hours, maybe a day at most. Wow, so when you get infected, you die really quickly, or I suppose turn. I hope the smuggler is still coming so that I can see, or I can at least pass this note to you. I should have listened to you and come to the zone with you when I had the chance. Now it's too late. Take care, Mark. Damn, that's so tough. The infected trying to sneak into the zone. As much as everyone complains about it, Got all these poor bastards wishing they were living on the inside. So if you get if you get exposed to the spores, you turn really, really quickly. Alright, well that's good to know. Fresh air. <laughs> <sighs> Fresh air. No smell of it's rotting flesh. Love it. Why don't you ask Bill to get you some of them air fresheners? Hey, if they weren't expired, that'd be a good idea. Good point. I'm still not quite sure what happened to the city. I swear it looks like it was bombed. Perhaps the government bombed the city, uh, hoping to wipe out any of the people that may be inside that are infected. I'm not sure. Or maybe all the chaos that ensued afterwards. Who knows? 
Yeah, look at this place. Man, there's no way 20 years has made this big of a difference to the uh, structural integrity of these buildings. Floors collapsing and everything. Damn it. Plank fell down. Oh, come on. It's a small jump. You can make it. Be a deer, would you? Uh, okay. Of course. Don't worry. I love to do work. Let's not forget I was wounded. The soldier shot me t 20 years ago, obviously. But still, you know, sometimes wounds take 20 years to heal. All right, here you here, go. Pass it to me. Man, this is a very shady plank to be using to try and cross uh, a gap in a building. <laughs> it's like, uh, well, let's just say it's kind of rotting. It's just a, a little bit. Heavy. I think I can handle it. Damn, right. She has got muscles, though. Well, I'll tell you what, since you have such confidence in that rusty, uh, that, well, rotting plank, I'll let you be the first one to cross it. Okay, now how the hell do I get back up there? Oh, right. Go around. Duh. There we go. Okay, she crossed, so it can't be too dangerous, right? <laughs> Man, you love to take a lot of unnecessary risks, don't you? And my knees are broken. Make sure there ain't any soldiers around. Clear. Come on. All of this to find one guy and exact a little bit of revenge. Seems a bit unnecessary. But then again, revenge is uh, a worthy thing to pursue. Shut it. I was just about to ask. I think I should be looking around for ammo, but then she answered my question that I was thinking. I see how it is. You can read my mind. Hey, little man. Make sure the coast is clear. No soldiers, none of Robert's men, yeah? You're just gonna trust her? All right, then. You know he's expecting this. Well, that'll make it more interesting. Good to go. Come on. Hey, Tex, hey, Tex. Hey, pretty lady, how you doing today? I heard you Not right now, Terrence. No, 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 it's, it's good. Look, Not I got the car. now, you hear me? This guy okay. seems like he's a crackhead. <laughs> you guys no, can get amphetamines out here, huh? Incredible. Crackheads even during the apocalypse. Oh, sorry, man. These dogs are all accounted for. Sold out in less than an hour. Try me next week. Oh, this is the black market. Oh, of course. So we're a black yep, market runner. Starving. Keep your shirt on. Oh. It's coming right up. I think I'd rather I starve to death than resorting to eating rat egg. meat. I'm waiting on this rat forever. If he ain't got ration cards, don't even waste my time. I'm not interested in bartering for bullets. All right then, sassy. My man, what are you gonna do? Holding that rusty pipe as if I'm supposed to be scared or something? You're not intimidating me. I got He's a gun with day. bullets. You know, pew pew. You, you can't swing fast enough to dodge a bullet. Let me tell you why. Ah, nothing like the smell of rat being cooked on a skillet with no salt or any type of uh, garnish at all. Oh yes, look at that. That is just uh, mm, mm, delicious. <laughs> so yeah, for now, I think I'm gonna leave it off there. Next time we'll go find out what happened to Robert or rather what's going to happen to Robert for trying to ambush Tess and to steal our supplies. I mean, that is not a nice thing to do. This game is heating up fast. Joel lost his daughter. I also noticed that he still has the watch on that his daughter gave him at his birthday 20 years ago. That's so sad, man. I, I can't believe this game has already stabbed me in the heart. It just started and already things are so intense. But yeah, hope you guys are enjoying this so far. I think this is going to be a really fun series and I can't wait to see how this game unfolds. If I'm being honest, for a game that came out in 2013, well, 2014, this is the remastered version, it doesn't look too bad. I'm actually gonna have a lot of fun playing this and I'm super excited to find out what happens. If you guys are excited for this to be a series, smash the like button, leave a comment down below, and until next episode, peace out. Also, I figured out how to use my flashlight. I'm kind of a doofus. When I was down under the building and uh, there were those bodies and the spores, I didn't turn my flashlight on. I know that probably triggered about 90% of you, but now I know how to use my flashlight. So, fun times with Beastie, the man that can't play video games. Until next episode, peace out.